Hi everyone, this is Bill. I want to talk to you today about the Chrome browser and one of the ways that you can manage multiple accounts inside of the Chrome browser. Now when you launch Chrome, chances are you're going to get a window very much like this if you are not signed into your browser. I highly recommend that you sign into your browser because that will sync your bookmarks and, and keep everything in Google's cloud so that wherever you sign in to Chrome, you will be able to get all your stuff quickly and easily. Now one thing that I do want to warn you about is this doesn't really work on Parkway purchased Chromebooks because of the way that we have to manage those Chromebooks for students. So understand that this is for your laptop or your desktop computer or if you want to set this up on a personal computer where you can flip back and forth between Google accounts. So setting this up is pretty straightforward. First of all, you're going to want to go ahead and log in to your Google account. So let me log into mine. And as soon as I'm logged into my Google account, what it's going to do is it's going to tell me that I'm signed into Chrome. Now this isn't something that we really want our students to do. We don't want them to keep signing into Chrome because most of the computers that they use are shared computers. So this is specifically meant for teachers or maybe even students at home. That would be fine. So I'm going to click OK. I got it right here. And you will see up in the upper right hand corner that it shows that I am signed in. And you're also going to notice that right underneath here, this is these are my bookmarks that I have put inside of Chrome. Anytime that I log into Chrome, those bookmarks will automatically sync. Now what's nice about this is that gives me the ability to work in a familiar environment regardless of the computer I'm using. So my bookmarks will always be there because as soon as I log into Chrome with my Google account, all of that stuff syncs. Now in order to set up two accounts on your computer, what you have to do is you have to go into the settings. Now the settings in Chrome is in the upper right hand corner. You're going to see these three little lines right at the end of your URL bar. Click on those three little lines and go down to where it says settings. And when you click on settings, it's going to take you kind of into the back end of Chrome. Now scroll down a little bit and you're going to see an option that says users. And one of the options there is add new user. And when I click on that, first of all, I'm going to be given the option to find a picture that will be for that particular account or that particular profile. So in this case, I think I'm going to be a ninja. Okay, so let me go ahead, call this, I'm going to call this Gmail, just so I can distinguish between this email address, my Gmail address, and my Parkway apps address. And then if I want to, I can make a desktop shortcut for that user. At this time, I'm not going to because I don't want to clutter up my desktop. Click Create and it's going to open up a new window asking me to log in. Now you're going to notice right up here in the left upper left hand corner, here's my little ninja guy. Okay, so this shows me visually which account I'm logging into. So let me go ahead and log into my personal account. And when I log into my personal account, again, it's going to say that I'm signed into Chrome. Say, so, okay, got it. And you're going to see up here, my information is different now. So let me pull this window over a little bit and you're going to see. So here is this window back here has a musical note. This is my Parkway Google account. And down here, oh, it changed because I have this set up on another computer. So my Gmail account is signified by this little uh, head. And if I click on either of those two icons, what's going to happen is I'm going to have it's going to show me my two accounts. So here's my Google account, and then down here is my Parkway account. Now, if I want to flip back and forth between these, I can just click on the little head or the music note and choose the other account. And what that's going to do is that's going to have two different accounts signed into two different browsers. 
and each of those kind of runs on its own. So anytime that I see the little head up here, I'm gonna know that I'm in my personal Google account. Anytime I see the music note, I'm gonna know that I'm in my Parkway account. And so this way I can manage going back and forth fairly easily and fairly quickly. You're also going to notice on here that all of my bookmarks synced from my personal Gmail account. So all of this information is stored in the cloud. When I sign in, it all syncs down to my browser, but this really gives me a lot of flexibility in terms of creating a way for me to move back and forth between these two different browsers. I hope that helps and I hope it makes it easier for you to manage multiple accounts inside of Chrome when you're signing into Google. I find it very helpful and very useful. Every computer I use that I'm going to be using consistently, I will always set this up. So good luck and let me know if I can help.